Hi YouTube, just in one second here and today I'm going to tell you guys how to get this cool little uh, slider icon. I'm going to tell you guys how to customize your own slider or you can simply go to Cydia and download it for free. So we're not going to use Winterboard for this except if you want to download the, um, the slider on Cydia you need to have Winterboard. If you want to have a custom one you don't have to download Winterboard. So for this Cydia slider you want to go to section then scroll down till you find theme then find uh, lock screen, uh, no, yeah, lock screen, right there, lock screen, click on this, and those are all the lock screen that you can have, or you can simply customize your own, like what I did over here, so you also need to go to Cydia, and uh, you want to download open SSH, we're not going to download uh, uh, automatic SSH because it won't work. Just type SSH and click search. Or you or now we're using the newest way to do it because the old way won't work. So click on open SSH, install confirm. Then after that, you'll probably need to respring. I don't know. And after that, you need to uh, SSH your iPod. Which is pretty easy and uh... alright to SSH your iPod you need to have this program called iPhone Box is the newest way to SSH to your iPod and it is the best way so um, I'll put a link below so go to that link then uh, what you want to do is uh, wait five seconds to one Then you click on skip add. Then you choose your version uh, for Mac or Windows and download the program. So yeah. After you downloaded the program, you want to choose a lock icon. I choose this gun. I don't know why, but so uh, you want to save it to your desktop. And uh, that that's the oldest uh, lock icon that I had. And um, now I change it to the original one because I want to show you guys how to do it. So uh, after that, you want to go again to your internet browser, then search on Google or uh, here, somopaint.com. Somopaint. This is the best way to um, do your to edit your image, and it's free. You don't have to download anything. It's right on here. So click on open from computer and uh, here's the airsoft image then now what you want to do you, you want to click on image image size this is the most important part so you want to click you want to uh, enter the, the right size or else it will be too small or too big so it's 71 by 47 then click on OK. So that's what it gives you. Then after that, click on File, Save to My Computer. And now, this is also important, you want to click on PNG. So there's, uh, the name, just PNG now is good. Save it to your desktop. Desktop, save. OK. To make to uh, make it work, you need to change the name. So, uh, as you can see, the name for the slider icon should be bottom bark uh, bark note grain dot png. So you want to click on rename and copy this. I'll put the link. Uh, I'll put the name in the description below so you guys can copy it over there then rename this and paste it uh, before you paste it of course you want to change his name or else it will be the same to one 
all right then rename this paste it then you have you have your um, slider icon now you want to plug in your iPod to your computer then open your iPhone box wait okay there you go now what you want to do is click on raw file system then you want to click on system library then scroll down till you find um, private from frameworks click on this then go all the way to T and click on uh, oops what did I just did that was bad sorry for that I don't know what I just did but I don't think it was good so where am I all right then Paris there all the way down to find T then you want to click on telephony UI dot uh, framework click on this and again the, the step that I just told you will be in the description box so you won't be lost then uh, you want to scroll down and you can see that as you can see those are the um, icon that you have on your iPod so this one is the lock screen what you want to do is um, rename it rename rename uh, 21 just add a 21 I don't know why but just add a 21 then you want to click you wanna click on this and copy to your PC then choose a place where you want it to be I'll just save it at the, uh, my dust desktop and why you're doing this is because you don't want to lost if you miss if you did a mistake you won't lose your original lock uh, lock icon so do this I suggest you to do it so there you go you have it right here 21 okay now what you want to do is drag your icon to this uh, place then I'll scroll down and you can see that yours is over here the good one and the bad one oh yeah before you want to rename it you want to you want it to only be one PNG because I added one I don't know why but you want the name be like this and if you want to have a um, I don't know what's that for but um, if you want to have a power down shut down lock icon you could change it do the same step but just change the name to bottom bark uh, no red dot png so it's the same thing do whatever do the same thing that I told you to do then after that you can delete the original thing delete okay after you delete it you're pretty much done I suggest you to refresh right here then what you want to do you want to respring your iPod or shut down and all right guys as you can see I turn it to the uh, original lock icon focus okay there you go so um, let's just respring the after you did what I did just click on respring or just hold the power button and slide to shut down all right let's just wait it, it shouldn't take that long and boom there you go as you can see the gun that I choose for it is right here it's perfect size and slide boom unlock and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you're wondering how I got um, this te custom text just in one second normally it's a um, slide to unlock but you can choose your text <clears throat> I mean your yeah your text by yourself if you want to know how to do that 
click the annotation right here okay and uh, again thanks for watching I hope you enjoy and uh, I'll see you soon bye